everybody welcome to fame world educational hub myself ashwarya saxena and in this java 19 tutorial series i am going to start with a new program today in the previous videos i have already discussed the basic concepts of java and also control statements have been started in this video i am going to talk about one more program like i will be demonstrating one program of for loop one program we have already seen previously in the previous video so i hope you have watched them so here i am going to take a program that is write a program to print 10 numbers in reverse order with a difference of 2 okay so this we will be doing with the help of for loop so i am taking here class pro 17 public static void main integer i i am taking here simply and for like 10 numbers we have to print in reverse order with a difference of 2 that means you can consider 20 18 16 this way we can go so i'm taking here i equals to 20 that is the initial value here and i greater than 0 and i equals to i minus 2 so syntax of for loop i have already discussed previously so please check the video in case you have not watched then i i am going to print here Firstly, let me run this program and then I will tell you the dry run also. So, java c space pro 17 dot java and java space pro 17. So, here you can see we have received the accurate output as we should get and our program is working absolutely correct. So, I am going to demonstrate the dry run also that uh, how this particular program is actually working. So, the code which we are having that is like for i equals to 20, i greater than 0, i equals to i minus 2. So, here I am just uh, like taking system dot out dot print ln i this we are doing. So, we are having i equals to 20. Then i greater than 0 that means 20 greater than 0 that is true. So, it will come inside the loop and it will print the value of i that is 20. Then it will again go up like this. I have already told before also and I am again telling you that uh, what happens like this is checked first. Then once the condition is true, it will come inside and it will print the value. Then it will go up and it will just check the like increment or decrement. Then it will again come to the condition. Then again the printing. So, this way it goes. Okay. So, here... Uh, it will now go to the i equals to i minus 2. So, it will be having the value of i 18 now because of i minus 2. So, i equals to 18. So, 18 greater than 0 condition true. So, it will come inside and it will print the value 18 I have printed. Like because we are having the new line character added, it's like a slash and uh, sorry, print ln is used. So, it will be simply locating the cursor to the next line automatically. Then i equals to i minus 2, so it will be 16. So, 16 greater than 0, that is true. So, it will again come inside and it will print the value 16. So, this way it will be going on and then it will check i equals to like, let's say 1, uh, sorry, 2. So, when i equals to 2, so 2 greater than the, uh, 2 greater than 0 condition true then it will print the value 2 then it will again check like i equals to i minus 2 that means i equals to 0 and 0 greater than 0 condition false so as the condition will be false the loop will be terminated and we will be getting the values from 20 to 2 according to the like formula which we have given like i minus 2 that means 10 numbers in reverse order with a difference of 2 so you can see this program is working efficiently and I hope you have got the idea that how the internal working of it is going on. In case you have any query, you are free to ask your queries in the comment section. Don't forget to subscribe the channel and like the video. Subscribe the channel, hit the notification bell because after pressing the notification bell, you will start getting the notifications of my latest uploads. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned and see you in the next video.